it's shower time and clean the bathroom time. I figured if I'm gonna start doing this, I need to do it in separate spaces. So I'll do one room at a time um, while doing the new routine. So I've got a messy counter. It's all, I mean, I use the stuff, but I don't, I don't know why I don't just put it away because I'm stupid. And then this morning, I didn't film it, but I cleaned my closet and hung everything up. We're doing good. Now it's shower time and you're not allowed to be around for that. Okay, hello. Um, so, um, hi, I guess this is technically day two of the getting my life together thing. Um, I, I'm pretty sure, um, I've been cursed because um, yesterday was really bad. I got in a fight with my roommate and I got some bad news about two family members who are in the hospital right now. Um, the, I went out last night. Um, I went out with my father to a comedy club and we had to leave early because he had to go to the ER and, um, my aunt is in the middle of um, recovering from a heart and a kidney transplant or liver transplant, I think. Um, if you hear that, that's uh, the tornado sirens. That's not why I'm in the closet. I'm in the closet so nobody can hear me talk to myself, but um, there is tornado sirens going on and that's why my animals are kind of clingy right now. Um, I did want to mention that in my description in this video, there will be a link to a, um, GoFundMe page, uh, for my aunt. Um, she's currently homeless, so when they discharge her, she will have nowhere to go. Um, so if you, if you can help, um, that would be appreciated. I, uh, ended up going back out at around midnight and, um, I just kind of sat around in a public park with my friend until, like, 4 a.m., 3 a.m. or something in the city. Um, and uh, I guess that did make me feel better. So I I did leave the house. Um, we ended up doing a lot of walking, so exercise. And uh, I ran the dishwasher today, so I cleaned. And yesterday I did shower. So I think we're doing pretty good. Hi, buddy. Um, and now we're just waiting on the tornado. So um, if anybody uh, knows how to get the universe to stop hating you, please let me know. Great onion from the grocery store that I put in a pot and regrew. Pretty freaking sick. So, the plan was to eat dinner. I'm not trying to, like, this isn't really, like, bad. Um, okay, so basically, uh, the plan was to eat dinner and then go for a walk because I haven't moved all day. I've been working since 4.30. And I can't hold my phone any higher, otherwise I'll look like a psychopath. So I don't want anybody to see me. So you get this angle. And that's what you have to deal with. Somebody. I know somebody can see me, but that's fine. I, I don't like being perceived. But, um, anyway, that was the plan. To go walking or whatever, at least like two miles. Um, even though it will kill me. This is what I look like in the wind. Don't get bangs, because if you get bangs and it's windy outside, I swear to you, the wind will betray you every time. Pretty long walk all the way down. I found a park. It's the church parking lot, and the last time I swing on a swing at a park, 
uh, I broke the swing, um, which was really embarrassing because it was a super thick chain. Um, but I weighed a lot more back then, so understandable. If this breaks, I'm probably going to have a mental breakdown. Also, it is sprinkly, but the clouds are so sparse that I think it'll go away. I don't know, I'm already out here, so it's raining a lot. I left the park because there is a child, and I didn't want to make the mom feel uncomfortable. So I'm like just an adult hanging out at the park, so I just like left. I hope she doesn't think I left because of her. I just left because I didn't want to. I don't know. You know, that was a train. I hate them. They scare me. I'm so scared of trains. But it is officially raining. Um, so, you know, I'm like debating whether or not to go back to my apartment because I know as soon as I get there, it'll probably stop raining. So I'm just kind of hanging out. Um, I feel like if I go into town, I can at least walk around like a store or something. I don't know. We're praying. <laughs> regretting it yet, so this is it. I want to explore like woods or something, but there are none. So, yay. Okay, so it's pretty windy, windy and like way more rainy than it was before, so I'm gonna try and get across the street as quick as possible so I can steal that. I want to steal that so bad. But I can't because that's not good. Shouldn't do that. Um, anyway, it's raining a lot. Um, but there's trees up there on this side, so I think I'll be okay. Uh, I'm trying to run from the rain, uh, just at a slow leisurely pace. Do you need a vacation room? I want it. It's free. As a kid one time, I used to ride this big mountain bike. I didn't even like, honestly, almost every bike I had, ooh, shelter. I may stay under here, but I don't want to face towards anybody's houses, but I used to ride a mountain bike. It was so large. In fact, that I had to use a rock to get on top of it. And, um, but this time I was ready in the yard because I had a super hilly yard. Oh, there's people. I don't think I'm disturbing anybody here, but anyway, I would ride it around on these big hills down the back of my house. And there's this tree along the horse fence in the back. I think I have a picture of it, but. I smacked straight into it um, and it hit my face and I didn't think anything of it honestly I was just like oh ha ha that's funny because it wasn't like big it was like little branches but it was poison oak apparently or something and my face like blew up like a balloon and that sucked but it was also kind of funny because it's like it looked like I got stung by a bee 
but for the longest time, we couldn't figure out what it was until like I had healed and I was all better and I went back outside and uh, I saw that tree that I'd smacked into because I moved out of the way. I was going down my same path because I like to go down the hill and go super fast. And um, I was like, oh my God, that smacked the right side of my face that blew up. So I showed it to my mom. My mom like Googled it and that was back in like 2010, I think it was 10. And uh, so, you know, you did the best with what you got. There was no like Google lens, unfortunately. It's very dry here, so I'm gonna stay here. But there was no Google lens. You know what, on second thought, I think I'm gonna leave. Because that cloud is coming this way. And yeah, no. I don't feel like dealing with that. But basically, but yeah, so I'm allergic to that. I think everybody is. I think it's just something, I mean, it is called poison oak. See, it is bone dry here. I am staying right here. That's not my neighborhood, but my neighborhood's down there. I'm just gonna stay here. I feel like this is the safest place. It's, it's I am getting really wet though. <laughs> Let me see if I can get back here. Oh, this is much better. The back side of the tree. I'm much drier. I want to climb this tree, honestly, but I would like, I'd probably die. So I was just informed that this is about to turn into a severe thunderstorm. So your girl's getting her cardio in. I'm not going to film this because uh, it's raining, raining. I love the outdoors. It's so nice. And refreshing. Shame on me for wanting to exercise. I won't be won't be doing that anymore. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna go take a shower and I never attempt to touch grass ever again. I would just like to form you that. This is the weather, now that I'm home. And honestly, I'm gonna take that personally. 